And so it begins in Pullman. It, it is the tip-off week presented by Liberty Mutual Insurance. Welcome to the Palouse, home of the Washington State Cougars. And it is the battle of this region tonight. It is renewed. The Idaho Vandals on the road to begin this season tonight at the Beasley Coliseum. Great to see everyone again. Greg Heister, Dan Dickow. A rivalry game to begin a new season. It is. These schools only separated by nine miles on Highway 270, the Palouse-Moscow Highway. But this date has been scheduled, circled on the calendar for some time for every player and coach at the college level. Yeah, and you can tell by these numbers, 278 meetings between these two schools. It is a heated rivalry, Dan. Been around a long time. It was the longest running rivalry series in America until, unfortunately, last year. Here's Miles Rice. What a story he is. Hodgkin's lymphoma last season, a medical red shirt. He is in remission, has been cleared to play. He's going to be fun to watch this season. Uh, brings a quickness that they didn't have a season ago as Yakamoski finds the angle on the baseline drive, finish the foul, a chance of the three point play. Yakamoski right away, he's the threat from downtown but he proves he can put it on the floor with that play. And now Andre goes to the free throw line. Well, he's a player that typically has just hunted shots on the perimeter. If he's added the ability to make ball screen reads, that is a huge bonus for Washington State. And the miss, but the putback is good by number 20, Ruben Chinyelu. That shot for three well off. And now the deflection inside, Yakimovsky with it for Washington State. Bryce is trailing, Miles with it. Jump shot on the way, good. As good a start as the Cougars could have asked for. Active defensively. This is Neal with a drive. You saw Jones inside cutting him off. Janielu challenges the shot by Kyson Rose and wins the battle. Yesifu from downtown. That's what he can do. Idaho. Only three returning players, only one of which played a decent amount of minutes a season ago. Big rebound by Jones off the Yakimovsky miss. Six on the shot clock. The Wentz who go to work, hangs in the air, and hits the bucket, big bucket there. And that ends the skid for the Cougars. Tough shot to Wentzu. And now Isaac Jones steps through, shot up is short. Got the rebound, up and good chance for three for Isaac Jones. Four. Lots to the post. Kinyelu. Bounce to Jones. Isaac goes right to the rim, the slam, it's 22-10. Drive the kick. Frank jump shot off the front of the rim, loose ball. Picked up by Watts. Isaiah, transition three, bingo! 25 to 12 and the Vandals now four turnovers in the last six plus minutes and Yakimovsky took his time with that lined it up this is Linhart on the drive but Ginyelu was there with the defense he and Isaac Jones I like Kamani really versatile player played in all 34 games last season for Washington State so he's a guy with experience too Rice down the lane left hand looks great bucket goes to take advantage of Yesifu's quickness. He's got the ball. He won't give it up. He's into the lane. Left it off. And it's the horn sounds. Oscar Clough, his first field goal. And there you see what Joseph Yesifu can do for Washington State. A little over four seconds. Baseline to baseline. Terrific composure and understanding of time to deliver it to Clough. It's 10 on the shot clock. Yakimovsky, his first look at three this half, and it's true. Yakimovsky with 14. Good patience from Jones to make sure the defense commits on the double before finding Yakimovsky. Chinyelu with the big block, and now transition offense for Washington State. Yesifu, the drive, and the finish. There's a highlight. The quickness, the ability to reject the pick and roll, get all the way to the rim in no time and finish, impressive. But it starts defensively on one end, Dan with the block, and then the transition offense, the run out, the great finish by Yesifu. And again, good defense by Chinyelu. 
And Yakimovsky with it for Washington State. Yakimovsky again from downtown. Perfect. He's playing with a lot of confidence, which is exactly what you want to see. It's so important for Yakimovsky to be able to hit those shots and keep the defense spread out. Oh, it's a, a shooter with size. Jones, bounce, and the flush. A little high-low Oscar Clough. Well, and you're talking about the two guys spotlighted there. They're older players who've been around the college game, Jones and Yakimovsky, so they understand when defenses make certain reads, how to make them pay. That time, yeah. terrific footwork, especially with a backup point guard like Darling in there, just to kind of get them to take some time off the clock and not easily get into the offense. But Isaiah Watts, <laughs> he might be another deep ball threat. Throw to the post. Nice catch by Clough. The kick out. Yakimovsky, the drive. The reverse. That 6 8. Great finish. Andre with 19. Well, we're seeing an all new player. I in agree. Andre Yakimovsky. Well, they're still within striking distance with the way that they shoot the three. They haven't knocked it down at a big clip, but they're willing to shoot it. Oh! What a finish with the left hand by Yakimovsky. Yeah, early in the season, you're going to see. I think different options, different lineups. You've got the speed with Rice as Chinyelu takes advantage of the flop from Lindhart. Mullins yet to hit a shot here tonight. He's hunting a three now. On the way, bingo, Jake Mullins from downtown. Pick and roll. The slam for Washington State. Right around 36%, but they've got decent size and length for the big sky. Their guards are skilled. Wintsu, the drive. Sorry, Dan. And the roll goes. A big time finish there from Wintsu, but when you look at the big sky, you've got to find a way that you can distance yourself sty stylistically. I think Idaho could do that. I think they're a lot more talented than what a 10th place team in the big sky would look like. Then on the shot clock. Rose both the way by Yakimovsky picked up by Mullins up the floor to Rice lay in. That's fast. Tell you what he gets out in transition in a hurry. Kamani now will back it out. Take some time off the clock. Cougar shooting 52% for this game. Rice. Here's Rice with a drive. For the game, they're at 53.6%. Rahosi chases it down. The dish and the flush by Oscar Clough. Clough now with eight points. And Washington State begins the season with an 84-59 final. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got more basketball coming your way. We're going to take a timeout right now for Beasley Coliseum.